October 3rd, St. Therese of the Infant Jesus. Marie Francois Therese Martin, known as the Little Flower of Jesus, reared in a home of comfort and surrounded by refinements that would have spoiled an ordinary child therese's intelligence had an early dawning which enabled her to comprehend the divine goodness far in advance of her tender years our lord visited upon the child a severe trial a strange malady from which there seemed no recovery her implicit confidence in god however overcame her infirmity and she progressed rapidly toward sanctity therese adopted flowers as the symbol of her love for her divine saviour and offered her practices in virtue sacrifice and mortification as flowers at the feet of jesus at fifteen she entered the carmelite convent at lesieux france where she distinguished herself by punctual observance of the rule burning love for god and a wonderful trust in him before she died this lily of delicious perfume as pope pius x called her revealed to the superiors her life story in her book story of a soul after suffering much agony and pains through the disease of tuberculosis she died in the odor of sanctity on september thirtieth in the year eighteen ninety seven at the age of just twenty four since her death countless graces have been attributed to her intercession in nineteen twenty three the church approved two spontaneous cures unexplained by medical treatment sister louise of st germain was cured of the stomach ulcer she had between the years nineteen thirteen and nineteen sixteen the second cure involved charles ann a twenty three year old seminarian who was dying from advanced pulmonary tuberculosis the night he thought he was dying charles prayed to therese afterwards the examining doctor testified the destroyed and ravaged lungs had been replaced by new lungs carrying out their normal function and about to revive the entire organism these two miracles resulted in therese becoming beatified in nineteen twenty five two cures had been investigated and judged to be supernatural through the intercession of st therese the first involved gabriel from parma italy gabriel had suffered from arthritis of the knee and tubercular lesions on the vertebrae the final miracle involved maria palmas of belgium maria suffered from pulmonary tuberculosis which had spread as therese's illness had to the intestines the diagnosis of pulmonary and intestinal tuberculosis was made by her doctor who also examined maria after she came back from visiting therese's grave the doctor testified i found her literally transformed this young woman out of breath from the least movement moves about without fatigue she eats everything given to her with a very good appetite the abdomen presents no tender point when formerly the least pressure produced severe pain all symptoms of tubercular ulceration of the intestine have disappeared after these last two miracles were validated she was canonized on may seventeenth in the year nineteen twenty five